first of all, we have to say welcome back. We love seeing you. Thank I love you, you girl. You know this. Uh, happy anniversary. Thank you. That's right. <laughs> you and your husband, Trey, recently celebrated your second year wedding anniversary. What did you guys do? Oh, my God. <laughs> yes, I love him so much. Um, Oh my gosh, we relaxed. We went horseback riding. We made ceviche. Ooh, nice. His was better than mine. Oh, oh wow. Okay. That's good. It's like, are you going to start cooking, boo? <laughs> okay. Um, yeah, just massages. We just had a really great time. Oh, that sounds like a good I one of the best surprises, you guys, on my honeymoon. You guys have no idea. <laughs> I literally arrived on my honeymoon, and all of a sudden, this stunning couple comes walking towards me, and they're like, hey, girl. I'm like totally confused. <laughs> Guys, it was Grace and her husband, Trey. They were on my honeymoon. <laughs> this, literally, and we ended up hanging out and yeah. having the best time. I almost made you miss your flight because we were having the longest breakfast of life. Awesome. <laughs> it was awesome. Such it was so time. funny because there, there they were. And I was like, oh, and, I, and I've known Israel for a long time because of mm -hmm. his music. And yes. of course, watching The Real, knew you, and also because of your music as well. But like when I saw him, I was like, oh, that's Adrian and Israel. And, he, and Trey was like, who? And I'm like, we know them. We are, hey, y'all. <laughs> and Adrian is like, who? I was so, because you guys know when you see somebody out of your element, you're just yeah, like, wait, confused. what? I was like, oh, my God, look okay. who it is. It was awesome, yeah, though. We talked for hours. It was yes. great. Well, love we it. love awesome. you and Trey, and we love both of you on Empire. Yes. We yes. love you, too. Before y'all got married, y'all were dating other people. So how'd y'all hook up? So, well, Trey, Trey was single. Oh, he was. Yeah, he was definitely single. But you had somebody. I did. So I was, I was dating somebody at the time, and what was so interesting was that I was sure that I was gonna marry this person because I was like, mm -hmm. you know, we're in this, yeah. you know, we're gonna get married. But that spiritual connection mm. didn't, wasn't really there. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So, but even with that, I was like, you know what? We've been through a lot. We're gonna be mm. together. And when I met Trey, although the idea of dating him wasn't feasible to me, there was this spiritual kind of grab that happened that really made me go, okay. So we went to this event and I, and I said to my best friend who I brought and I was like, okay girl, there's this guy, never gonna date him. I'm mm -hmm. gonna marry the guy I'm with. But I just feel this spiritual pull and I just feel like I gotta tell somebody, I really feel like he's the one. Wow. I don't know how, and, I, and I'm pretty sure it's not gonna happen, but I just wanna say it. She's like, girl, you think he's, I was like, don't say it again, I don't wanna hear it again, I just need you just to be here to document it for me and that's yeah. it. Yeah. <laughs> that's it. Just deal with don't it. return it, that's it. Yeah. And months later, when we started dating, it turns out that the same week that I decided to break up with my boyfriend on my mm -hmm. own accord, yeah. right. mm -hmm. in the middle of the night, I was like, you know what, I, I feel like it's time that same week, in the middle of the night, God woke him up and told him that I was his wife. No way! Trey. Did, yes. Trey, yes. Oh, wow. Did not. We did not tell each other. Same no, week. Trying to get the names right. It wasn't a boyfriend. And no, Trey. Okay. Trey. Trey. Trey had the dream. Okay. Okay. Yes. Wait, so, and okay. We didn't know this until months later when we started dating. Yes. And I was like, he was like, yeah, there was this one week, and I said, which week? And he's like, this this second week of October, and I was like, that's the week that we broke up. Wow. wow. It was so absurd. Okay, wait, hold on. You and I believe in the same God, and how come he doesn't wake me up in the middle of the night with some messages like this?